Hey y'all, welcome to my channel. I don't know how you got here, but I'm glad you're here. I'm looking a total disaster today because I've been laying out. I've been playing with my mini, so sorry for the mess. Now for all of my Southern Charm lovers, such as myself, we all know that Thomas Ravenel T-Rav. So we know that T-Rav is not on Southern Charm anymore because of his pending charges he had and the allegations of we all know that. We're not going to dig into that. This is not what this video is about. This video is about Thomas just bought a new house and has baby number three on the way. And no, the baby mama is not Catherine. I know. Shocker. I was too. When I seen baby number three on the way, I was like, Catherine? <laughs> That's what I was thinking. So I done some research and I found some facts for you guys. And I'm just going to read them off here. And I'm going to insert some pictures when I'm done so you know what I'm talking about. Thomas Ravenel just purchased a $1.8 million home. The home is located in Aiken, South Carolina. It is known as the balcony. Insert pigs. <laughs> I know what you're thinking. Damn, Thomas, because that's what I was thinking. The property has 5.82 acres and boasts a 10,000. 552 square foot main living residence. The house has seven bedrooms, six and a half baths, and 10 foot ceiling. Also on the property, there is a 1,134 square foot guest house, which has three bedrooms and one and a half baths, and it's got its own stables, which is huge. I will show a picture of that as well. And we all know that's great for Thomas because Thomas likes riding horses and he does the polo thing, which is so weird to me. Like, fun fact, I did not know people like around here played polo until I started watching Southern Charm when it first aired years ago. Till recently, Thomas has been dating Heather Masco. I don't know if I'm saying that last name right, but yeah. She is a registered nurse from Charleston. He had been dating her like last summer, last fall, um, pretty sure at the beginning of this year, but now it's like been on hush hush. According to Celebrity Insider, an inside source has claimed that Thomas was trying to keep his girlfriend's pregnancy under wraps. He told Heather, sorry my bad. He told Heather not to go out and even people know who are afraid to say anything because Thomas is so aggressive when he is crossed. Ooh, shake it in my boots. I mean, I know I've heard people saying like, you know, they don't mess with Thomas because... Because of what? What's Thomas gonna do? Like, why is everybody so scared of Thomas? Because he's got money and he can, like, win court cases. Thomas has not been holding back on Twitter. He is coming to Catherine's defense in every which way. Because Catherine has been getting heat. You know, Catherine, baby mama number one. Catherine has been getting heat from, like, you know, the alleged racial tweets that she done. So he came to her defense over that. Then when it came out that Cameron and Naomi and Chelsea was saying that Catherine started the rumor that Cameron's husband was screwing around on her with this hairdresser from Charleston. They said Catherine started that rumor. Um, Thomas went in on that too. I've also been seeing a lot about the Heather girl, Thomas's 
alleged new baby mama, baby mama number three. Well, actually, it's baby mama number two. Baby number three, baby mama number two. God, that's confusing, even to me. Okay. So, baby mama number two, Heather. Heather's ex, which is a older guy that owns a bar in Charleston. Leo Chikahuti, well, well, I don't know his last name, don't know how to pronounce it, and not even going to try. Leo. Okay, so Leo has went to great lengths to disapprove and show his disapproval of this relationship between Thomas and Heather, which is his ex, and Heather and Leo share custody of their two children, which are teenagers. But yeah, look at the banner. Yeah, I said banner that Leo hung up about Thomas. I don't know. This is a whole damn mess on its own. And now I'm like, well, how are we going to know? How are we going to keep up? Because these people are not going to be on Southern Charm. And hell, with the pandemic going on and the film and being suspended, we don't even know when the next season of Southern Charm is going to air. So I'm over here like... What now? Um, but Thomas's baby mama number two, allegedly, is due in June, which is not far away, like days away. So I guess we will hear or see something out of that within the next few weeks. I don't know. I don't know. I just thought it was juicy gossip, so I wanted to share with y'all. If you like this video, leave me a thumbs up. Please hit that subscribe button and click the little bell so your notifications will be turned on. Also, do you know any inside scoop on Southern Charm or when it's gonna, you know, supposed to like air or if they're gonna resume their filming or if they're over there <laughs> filming now? Let your girl know. I want to know. I know I got jazz hands. Some people said on here, oh my God, she moves her hands too much. Get over it. Get over it. You're on the wrong channel. If you don't like how I talk and you don't like me moving my hands, yeah, yeah. And you don't like the shitty singing over here. I just love how it just like randomly ended my video with a rant. I don't like that. So peace and love. I'm going to end it with that. I love y'all.